KFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, this is Larry Pesavento setting in for Tom O'Brien today and giving you an update of what's going on in the markets. Uh, one of the things that uh, we've been talking about um, in the second segment of the show. Okay, I need clarity. I've got this little messed up, folks. I know it's me, but I'm not sure I'm supposed to be here. But I'm going to continue going because I think I'm the only one here. Anyway, I want to give you an update. The markets are coming back pretty strongly after these wild swings we've had, folks. Just to give you an example, we were down 250 points in the, S, uh, the Dow Jones today before the report. And then we rallied up 300 points in the S in the CPI report and then down 300 points in the CPI report. And now we're back to being up on the day in the Dow Jones. So we're having about an 800-point swing in the Dow Jones. And if you're just driving along the freeway listening to the old prices, you think it's a very quiet day, and it is far from that. We've had well over a $15,000 swing in the S&P and even more so in the NASDAQ, which is leading the pack uh, to the upside. The only market in the financial group that is still still uh, needing a great deal of life support, of course, are the Treasury bonds. They continue to be uh, working lower, or they have, found, they have found a little bit of support at lower levels here today. The same thing with gold. Gold broke uh, 1860 today. We got down to 1852. And uh, of course, you know, they're listening to the 24-7 segment that I give each day. We're looking for a price to find support around 1840 to 1835 is what we're looking for. Uh, in the gold market. But we're having great volatility, folks. You can't ask for anything better than this. Well, you can ask for it, but you might not always get it. So the main thing is, is to always remember what David White said. Sell when you want to, not when you have to. And the reason for that is, folks, patterns are there to tell you what the risk is in the trade. They're not going to tell you where they're going to go. It just tells you how much risk you have to take to put the trade on, because we don't know What's going to happen next? Nobody knows that. So the future is undetermined. It doesn't make any difference. So you just got to be able to live in the present. And that's why you wrap your present every day and live in the attitude of gratitude and always be thankful for what we have here. Think of if you were living in Turkey, folks, like, well, Istanbul isn't too bad, but Ankara was hit pretty hard and some of the other places. Hey, we'll be right back. 877-927-6648. A. Prowling and a growling for Tom O'Brien. Sharpening your skills.